Well, this morning we are talking about what's considered to be one of the world's healthiest foods, a little diversion from uh, tamales, a vegetable actually that literally dates back thousands of years. Not only are these beets tasty, but they're good for you and inexpensive. And you can easily incorporate them into your diet. Take a look. It's a common vegetable. We see them all the time. We pass them in the grocery store. We're talking about beets, and we're here in the kitchen of Michelle Fife, the owner of Seva Yoga. Okay, this is a really common vegetable, and I, I think they're good for you. Oh, they're very good for you, and you know, for a lot of years, I didn't even eat beets. I think this was something my mom's generation had, and they had pickled beets and weird things, and I really had a little bit of a fear of them, but one day, I ended up having some beets from my farm CSA, and I was determined to use them, so I started researching some recipes, and now I am a beet lover. I am a beet lover and um, beets are great for you. There's so many benefits to them so I try to find quick and easy ways that I can make them and prepare them and actually get my family to eat them. Okay, I love it because Michelle is actually going to show us a couple different ways that you can prepare a beet healthy and easy. Healthy and easy key. and quick because I got no time. Yeah. But um, So here's a beet salad that I've made. I actually marinated these grated beets last night. So these are just some grated beets and fortunately I had mm -hmm. a food processor so this was about a five minute recipe but it's just beets with a little bit of parsley and the marinade was some fresh orange juice a little fresh um, lemon juice olive oil and then of course the parsley and you know go ahead and um, give it a taste Ooh. if you like and then I just served it on a bed of some romaine lettuce and this would be a nice thing that I could serve some girlfriends um, at lunch maybe with a piece of bread and it is again nutritious mm. and delicious it's crunchy like a carrot. Yeah, it's but just that a citrus raw. is really Robbie. good. The color is beautiful. Yeah, the color. Yeah. And anytime you have a food group with a beautiful, rich color like this, you pretty much know it's going to be good for you. And this is part of the beet as well. Yeah, when the beets come, you know, they're, it's a root vegetable, so it's got a root on the end, and then this is the stalk, the leaves. And for about two years, I was buying beets, and I was actually throwing the beet leaves away until I found out that these are also edible. And now this is actually my favorite part of the vegetable. I like to saute these in some olive oil with some garlic and onion and then I put in a little red wine vinegar and um, a couple tablespoons of raw sugar and it's fabulous kind of sweet and sour dressing over these wilted greens and awesome. my whole family loves to eat these so hmm. again another great use you can eat the whole beet yeah well I love that you have really introduced us to smoothies in so the beet can actually be used in the smoothie as well yep that's what we're gonna do next so lately, um, since about fall, I've been incorporating these into my diets via a smoothie. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to make a little beet smoothie recipe for you. I'm going to use a beet. I'm going to use some strawberries and pineapple. This time of the year, I just have some frozen strawberries and a little bit of canned pineapple. But we're going to throw them in the blender and we're going to drink them. And nice. I think I'm going to make a beet lover out of you. Yes. Can't okay. wait. You ready? So you ready to try your first beet smoothie? I am. Okay. There you go. Enjoy. That's really good. Isn't it though? I like that. Okay, so not only does it taste good, there are a lot of health benefits too. Oh yeah, and I never just eat things because they're good for me. I also want them to be tasty, but th besides being delicious, this drink has antioxidants in it. It's an anti-inflammatory. Beets support your body's own natural detoxification process, and they're really good to improve the um, structure of your blood and cure digestive diseases. It'll actually help you to get rid of liver, kidney, and bladder stones. Wow. So beets are great. They're mm. great and often overlooked. Okay, not anymore, so no. uh, cheers. <laughs> <laughs> and I would never steer you wrong. Right. Or any of you. Really, really good and so nutritious. I'm like, this is delicious. my new vegetable. And they're so affordable when you go to the grocery store. No, you don't think about it. Let's have beets today, you know? No, you it. know, and it's amazing when you think about it in so many countries and you know, Russia, oh, yeah. the United States, yeah. here and other 
the beet is like everywhere because it's so easy to grow. Mm -hmm. It's a root vegetable. Mm -hmm. So the beet salad and smoothie are very simple as you can see. You can make them as varied as you want by adding other foods. And it seems lately I'm seeing beets all over the place. You know, Joy Walzak told me that she was just eating at a really popular restaurant in town yeah. and she had a beet risotto. Oh, God, that sounds wonderful. I know. Yeah. Interesting.